All right, so you guys might remember Simon. He's the mushroom guy. We're out the front of his house now because we want to give him a little gift. We pranked him. He's helped us prank, and he's all around just a ripper bloke. So today, we're giving back with a little help from Revolut. It's really sick. It's like looking at you is making me want to laugh. Why? Like, Revolut is a money managing app designed to make managing all your finances easier yeah. and they've already got 35 million shaggers using it. It's huge. We're able to transfer money directly to Simon's account in seconds. It's super easy to send and receive money using the app. You simply go in, select your mate, select the amount and it'll arrive in their account in seconds. Did you get it? Whoa! <laughs> really? Yeah, it's just 100%. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> this app is amazing. You have everything. You guys are sick. Plus, it's great when you've got friends and family across the world. It's literally two meters. I'm just seeing <laughs> There's no international transfer fees when sending money to friends and family who also use Revolut. We're always broke because we spend too much money on videos, so Pockets is a great Revolut feature that automatically puts cash aside every time we spend. We've set up some personal goals like a gym membership for Dan. Shaggers, if you need a smarter way to manage your money, then click the link in the description and check out Revolut. Alright, so Simon, you own a comedy club, Kings of Comedy. This is correct. Best comedy club in Australia? Pretty much. But our mate Lewis Spears, yeah. he played a show there a couple weeks ago. Yeah. And you helped us prank him. Yeah. Originally the idea was to get everyone to laugh at different points. Correct. We thought that it would be smarter to maybe get everyone to not laugh whatsoever. Yeah, and true. And you weren't too keen on this idea. No, right? not at all. Why? Why? Because I'm a comedian and I know what it's like to die. Wait, <laughs> it's you're a... a comedian? Yeah, look. I've never bit. noticed. So. Yeah, oh. so this guy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Shaggers, enjoy the video. You'll be able to see how much of a rubber arm this bloke has. <laughs> he wasn't that hard to <laughs> do. Hey, are we oh, good? Hey, brother. Oh, hey, brother. Oh, mate, we've been thinking. It's very <laughs> savage. Yes, like too savage. The first like two minutes, people were pissing themselves. Yeah. Then just. Dead. No one laughed. He's yeah. gonna tie right. a prank up. Yeah, yeah, I reckon no, you guys won't have me on this. On that one. Yeah, this is a good idea. Cheers. <laughs> Yeah. He's just Quickly. coming back. It could kill his career. That's fine. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> We're like four tickets off being sold out as well, so it's going to be a full house. Where do we go? How do we come in without the line on the stairs? No, because that's for the burgers and babes upstairs. Do so we go to Burger and Babes? No. Yeah. You can. Oh, ways it for girls. Yeah. No, guys. Burgers and babes. So for gays? No, no. You see girls. Wait, I'm sorry, I'm so lost. They used to be guys and now they're girls? No, 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 no. Burgers and babes or babes? Babes. Do they have their out? Yeah. So you know who we're dealing with here? We're doing a little prank on Lewis tonight. Oh, I get it, because he's the prank guy, so you're gonna do yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, thank you. Oh. Is that maybe, maybe one joke in yeah. there? See, I was like, we should get him laughing all of these guys, like, let's just dead air. Wait, like, what? The whole crowd's the whole not gonna crowd. laugh through his whole set. His whole set? <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna be funny. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna have to tell people when you sit down and just go, this guy here, when he comes on, a two, two jokes laughs, in. And then nothing. Then you're putting a lot of effort on the audience. Maybe no one laughs the I whole time. No one laughs because- oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm, with, like, I'm with Alyssa right here. How long are you giving him? 12 minutes. <laughs> That's but a long it, time, I know. That's gonna be a oh brutal... Oh my god, I thought like an hour was a long time. You're gonna use this as promo for the room? Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, that's, yeah, that's, yeah. That's, yeah. Eight minutes just of the crowd not enjoying the sound. <laughs> yeah, gosh, that'd be a good promotional video. Come down to the yeah, Kings of Comedy. Yeah, just say, what if he does all right? Are you gonna tell him you did this? <laughs> Because then what we have him walk back on stage like a gladiator or some <laughs> shit. <laughs> like, no one's laughing. You can easy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you just one of the whole time. It's like it's awful. No, it's gonna be so painful to watch. Holy sh! You see how he didn't ask about her pussy? <laughs> <laughs> it was so easy. I didn't even have to try. I'm sure it's lovely. I don't need to know. Everyone, quickly, quickly. So that comedian isn't here. I told him to come late tonight. Is everyone on board with this? So laugh when he says his name, which is Lewis Spears. And then after that, nothing. <laughs> you guys ready for a good night? Yeah. yeah. So let's do it. Let's sit down. Welcome to stage the one and the only Mr. Lewis Spears. Come on, we're going to do it. Come on. All right, make some noise. Okay. My name's Lewis Spears and I'm freakishly tall. I'm six foot eight which is exactly two metres tall, which is about this far away from being a disability, if I'm being honest. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's trouble, you know? I get two questions. You know what the first question is. You're so tall. You're so tall. Do you play basketball? Oh. Yeah. I want to look at these people and go, do I look like an athlete to you? 
I've got the lower half of a wounded flamingo. It's like, yeah, I'm tall, but I'm not also black. This is very strange. I feel like we should be all taking X and hooking up with each other and we'll get on Simon's level. <laughs> I don't know if anyone saw this. It happened uh, happened last year. I told some jokes about. He tried to he tried to get him to suck his tongue. Do you guys see this? No. Well, he had a little twelve year old boy in his lap, and he stuck his tongue out, and he said, "Suck my tongue." And I thought that's a little bit weird for the Dalai Lama to do. Not even the Pope does that. I mean, he does, but he, you know, he doesn't do it on camera at a press conference. He'll do it underneath the castle that they have. I told a few jokes about this. I said, the, I did my research, you know, the Dalai Lama, he's like the Buddhist version of Jesus Christ, except instead of having holes in his hands, he tries to put his kid hands in kids' holes. I don't know what the f happened, but I got up here and I feel like everyone agreed, all right, let's just sit in silence. This. What the f is going on? All right. But no, look, all right, we'll go back to the tall stuff. We'll try that. I feel like I tried the Buddhist stuff and you guys were like, I reckon I would join the protest. Yeah. You would? <laughs> I am tall, all right, but I don't, I don't play basketball, okay? Because I'm not, I'm not black. You know, let's give me a good backup plan though. If comedy doesn't pan out, which it's not right now, if comedy doesn't go well, I'll just get a black girl pregnant. Think about that shit. That's like an investment. Because potentially I've got the, 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 next, the next LeBron James just brewing in my balls. All I need is the other half of that recipe. Man, you fuck hate me, huh? This is maybe the worst I've bombed ever. I was doing this stuff in Perth and they were loving it. To be fair to Perth, they are very racist people. And disabled. <laughs> Other people will ask me if I also have a large penis. I actually feel really bad. <laughs> Can we tell? And the answer is I'm calling the police because that's, I mean, that's just sexual harassment. Like I would never, I would never ask a woman about the size, width and depth of her vagina. It's like, it's not like you seem like a lovely lady. What's your name, miss? Sally. Sally. What do you do for work, Sally? Chef. Excellent. Good on you. You see how I didn't ask about her pussy? <laughs> Sally loved that one. The rest of you were like, no, nah, we hate this guy. Is it the braces? I'm going to blame the braces so I don't myself tonight. <laughs> Maybe I'll just do the rest of the set as a conversation between me and Sally because she's f loving it. I don't know what these people's problem are. Because she's f loving it. I don't know what these people's problem are. You know what's really f is after this set, I somehow have to sum up the courage to invoice the guy running the gig. Free drink, Free drink card. That's a good one. I'll just get a Coke and go home and myself, all right? You guys have been lovely. I've been Lewis Spears. I tried my best. Have a good night. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's mean. Can we get it back up here? Yeah. Did you do that on purpose? <laughs> you fucking bro! No, no, all of you, bro. That was us, fucker. Oh my god, I am so upset. You know what's really bad about this? My last night in Perth, I actually really bombed. <laughs> so I was doing the same jokes, and it was the actual silence, and then I felt. Awful, got off stage and no one came out and was like, Oh, we got ya, I just suck. Ah! Oh my God. Thank you. That's all right. The audience did a great job. You bastards, that's so funny. I hate that joke.
Didn't you know I just say I feel like you've all agreed to not lie? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> there was one particular sentence that I really stumbled and stuttered off. Got the next. Oh my god! I think after that, that's when I started talking about. Myself. I'm still gonna invoice you. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. I'm still paying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If you actually do want to go see some good comedy, go to Kings of Comedy. 